Okay, we start out with a newly installed roof. You see the trailer over on the left, that's the uh, solar installer's trailer. And like a lot of these types of jobs, the preparation takes a lot of time and uh, the guys are setting up measurements for where the uh, supports are gonna go. Now they're actually starting to install some of them. The um, supports that actually hold up the solar panels are pretty critical and the way they're connected to the roof, uh, what's called a roof penetration. Whenever you go through the shingles, you wanna be very careful that you don't create a leak or a uh, attachment that will leak at some point in the next you know, 30, 40, 50 years. The, the shingles are rated at 50 years, so the intent is for the um, roof to not leak in 50 years or more. Um, so they use special uh, attachments there, and you can find more information on that on my annarborsolar.org website. And uh, then once the posts are attached with the flashings, they go ahead and install the aluminum rails that will actually support the, support the solar panels. And uh, here they're going to be installing 42 of those 230 watt panels. You can see the first ones installed there quite a group of people around because there's a lot of um, mechanical hardware to attach and tighten and then there's a lot of wiring that uh, that has to be done each of those solar panels producing 230 watts uh, there are three strings of 14 to add up to the 42 panels and uh, preparations all done now they can start putting them up see the uh, folks are going there the company that did this installation is Select Solar and Generator. Um, one of their guys grew up in the uh, Ann Arbor Ypsilanti area, uh, Mike Cooley. He's up on the roof there virtually the whole time supervising and working. Uh, really impressed with Mike. He did a great job. And the, uh, that company has, I think, uh, offices in eight or ten different states and a couple up in Canada, so they are pretty experienced in this kind of stuff. I was pretty pleased. And there's the installation.